everyone, Madeline Rascone here. I was just going to go over the importance of exercising and being healthy. I'm a really big supporter of just generally being healthy. I, I'm, I'm still kind of chunky, I'm sure you can tell I, I have a little bit of chunk on me. But I don't consider them too bad because I actually I jog for 18 minutes, five days a week. I eat no bread, no tortillas, no sugar. I only eat fruits, vegetables, and meat. I mean, I don't limit myself to the meat. I don't have uh, beef bacon. I do have turkey bacon instead. But what I'm getting at is how many successful people do you know eat junk food all the time, don't exercise, and have like zero energy? How many? comment below. Do, do you know people that are successful beyond their wildest dreams, beyond your wildest dreams, and they eat like shit. And they don't exercise. They don't take care of themselves. What happens to those people? They get health problems, don't they? They lose energy. They lose motivation. And it's hard for them to keep on going. That's why I'm such a big supporter, even though I'm still chunky. I am healthy. I feel great. I feel fantastic. I always have energy because I don't put anything bad in my body. I shop at Sunflower Market where everything is organic. I don't buy junk food. I don't eat butter. I don't eat bacon. I eat the leanest burger they have. That's usually bison burger. And I feel fantastic. And that's what I'm getting at is... If you want to be successful, not only to start up here in the mindset, but your whole body, everything, everything has to feel good, work together good. When you see successful people talking, don't they have a lot of energy, a lot of vigor, a lot of vitality? Don't they seem passionate and just really get into what they're all about? When I watch webinars, or when I do my own presentations, when I'm invited to do lectures for people, don't think that I'm just sitting on a stool just, well, this would work for you. This would be really good. I'm getting out of breath just sitting here, but, you know, if you go out there with the same attitude, just kind of hunched over, tired, not feeling good, you should get some awesome sales. No, I'm walking back and forth, the marker in my hand, in front of a whiteboard, writing stuff down, pointing at people, calling people on the stage, moving everywhere, doing activities, and you know what? I remain energetic. That's not a false front. I'm just energetic. I can be slightly overweight and be energetic because I eat so great, because I eat healthy. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gloating about my health habits, but... It is healthy. It feels good and it makes it so much easier to focus on success when you feel great. Uh, me and my husband both went on a journey together and lost a total of 70 pounds together combined. And you know what? That improved our work ethic so much. I mean, we were both successful salesmen to begin with. But the energy was starting to go down. We were both gaining weight. Our eating habits were starting to dwindle. We were drinking a little too much, you know, being too excited about the money coming in. And I realized, we can't keep up like this. Like, uh, the, the dude from Wolf of Wall Street may have been doing drugs and, and treating his body like trash can and still being wealthy and energetic, but I can't do that. And I'm not going to do that. I refuse. I'm not going to have drugs give me the energy to get through the day. I'm going to have food that my body needs naturally and exercise that everybody's body needs naturally. I'm going to have that stuff give me the energy to be successful. And I'm encouraging everyone out there, and this is really important, if you want to feel like a winner, if you want to feel like you can go out there and get them, you know what I mean? Start with the inside, you know? You gotta change the mindset, you gotta feel capable, you gotta feel like you can get at it and run your business, and you gotta feel in here, you know, in your entire body, you gotta feel like you're healthy, like you're vigor, you're vital, like you can do this for a hundred years, like you got the energy. Because, I mean, if you got drive and you got perseverance and you want to do stuff, 
but your body is sluggish, that is going to tie you down in a way that is just going to depress you, bum you out, and it's going to be it's going to be a bummer. So I'm really promoting everyone out there. That's why my saying is health, wealth, and happiness. You can be wealthy and, and not have the other things. Focus on your health. Focus on your mind. Be happy here, healthy here, and everything else will become wealthy around you. It's that easy. So everyone, stay healthy, happy, and healthy.